this video, I'll show you how to extend the background of a photo using Adobe Photoshop. Welcome back to the channel. My name is C Jam, and here we are inside of Adobe Photoshop, right? I have this photo that I got from Envisor Elements, and what we're going to be doing is extending the background, as I mentioned, right? Let's say you're working on a graphic and you have this stock photo, but you need more room to the left or to the right to put some text or some kind of element, right? Now, to do that, all I do is I just go ahead and duplicate the layer. Let me make this bigger for you. I duplicate the layer by hitting Ctrl J. Now that I have the background duplicated, I can just go to edit and then content aware scale, right? But before I do that, let me just zoom out and then hit C for my crop tool and extend the canvas some more, right? That way you guys can see how wide the photo is being extended. Let me turn this off and here's the photo that I'm extending this top layer here. All I have to do is go back to edit and then content aware scale and I'm just gonna hold Alt and Shift and drag on one of the sides and you'll see that the background is being extended right how cool is that and you'll notice let's go back to the before and the after but the more you use this especially on photos with a lot of elements in the background you know like this with the beach and so much elements photoshop still did a great job but if you were to look at the before and after you'll see there's a little bit of warping in the parents here let's go back before after before after i mean it's not going to be perfect because obviously you're stretching the background right and the water will look different if you look at it right here but i mean if you didn't know that i stretched this background you just wouldn't know right i know i have much more room to work with now let me hit another photo that doesn't have such a busy background this right here Let's duplicate the layer Control and J and we're just going to repeat the steps, right? Let me hit C for my crop tool. Oops, let me just extend the background here, right? And then turn off the one behind. Now let's go to Edit and then Content Aware Scale. You can do Alt, Shift, Control and C as you saw the shortcut there. And then all I'm going to be doing is clicking one side, holding Alt and Shift on my computer. And all I'm going to be doing is just stretching the background like so. And you can see I have tons more room to work with with text, right? See that the background isn't looking too terrible. It's actually usable, right? That is very usable if you ask me. Now you can go ahead and add something like text if you want or a lot of text and just write more room for text and you have a lot more room. So let me know, did you know that you can extend the background of a photo? using adobe photoshop now that you've seen how to do it how confident are you to start including it in your own workflow whether for yourself or for your clients let me know in the comments below and if you liked my photoshop tutorial and you want to see more of my graphic design tutorials click or tap the screen to watch this video right now